Dear Gachtene, and Tachten Sha by Mij Eg Faulum Fuin Breher Dane. This week we will be learning about the verb Dane, which is the verb to make or do. Beg to Eg Usaj on Breher Sha Gominic. You will be using this verb frequently. So pay attention. Ach erdus kahimid sul shir er an aim shir kacha loyrak agus ashanak. But first, we're going to have another look back at the regular past tense, present tense, and future tense. So erdus an aim shir kacha ta ich suguin go kurin mud h is jackson aim shir kacha. We put a H in to show the I'm Shrikacha. No diapostrophe mas gutta ata aun. Or a diapostrophe if we have a vowel. The only other big change in the I'm Shrikacha is when we're working with shin and muidj. When we're working with we, we put on a different ending. And that ending depends on whether the verb is lahan, broad, or quail narrow and it depends on whether it's in our first group which are the single syllable verbs or our second group which are the two syllable verbs so how do we say we in the past tense amur run amur we closed amur but with the e for the narrow version vrish amur we broke Iamer for our two syllable ones. Chianiamer, we bought. Iamer, but you'll notice the A is knocked off for our narrow one. Valiamer, we collected. If we want to ask a question, it's Er. Er gun tu, did you close? Er vrish she. Did she break? Er chianiamur. Did we buy? Er valig sheed. Did they collect? To say yes, we just give them the verb back. Gun me. I did. Vrish she. He broke. Chianig she. She bought. Valig tu. You collected. And if we want to say no, near. Er August near anish an i'm sure loihruk the present tense remember not i am going to the shops more like i go to the shops every week now we have an ending in the i'm sure loihruk and we use that ending for me to she she shin Mwij, shiv, and sheed. We can use this ending for any of them, okay? And it's on. Dunan. Here again, it's on, but with the E for the quail version. Brishan. In our two syllable group, Ian. Kyanian. And again, Ian, but with the A knocked off because it's narrow. Balian, Dunan, Brishan, Kianian, Balian, Dunan to on Fuinio Gok Ihe, you close the window every night. Brishan to the Pian Louis Gok Shockton, you break your pencil every week. Kianian to Bruntonus Gok Nullig. You buy presents every Christmas. Bali and she in a copular egg dera on lay. She collects the copies at the end of the day. Now, we can use that ending for me, but there is also a specific other ending we can use for me. Um. Dunum. Um. With the egg on. Brisham. Iam, Kianiam, 
Um, Balium. And as we know, there's always a separate ending for Shin and Wedge for we. Like I said at the start, you can actually use that first ending and just write sh Shin with it. So you could say Dune and Shin or Brish and Wedge, but this is really a better way to do it. So it's Amij, Dune Amij, we close. Amij with the A missing for the narrow one. Brish Amij, we break. E Amij, for our two syllable ones. Kani Amij, we buy. Amij, Bali Amij, we collect. And a slight difference here in our I'm sure Leuchruck, our present tense, it's on, not air, it's on for a question and knee for no. Okay, now we're going to look at the I'm sure Oshinuk, which is the future tense. We haven't done quite as much work on this as the other ones, and we will be doing more work on this in the future. But just like before, we have one ending that we can use for any of our persons. We can use it for may, to, she, she, shin, shiv, or shiad. And it's this. Now, you're looking at this and it looks like fade. But you'll hear the way I pronounce it now. Dune he. Now, you can pronounce it as a he or a fee. Most people would say he, so it's dun he, dun he too, you will close. Here it is again, you notice it's missing the A because it's narrow. Brish he, brish he she, she will break. O we, for our two syllable ones. Kiano we sheared, they will buy. O we, this time it has an E because it's narrow and it's missing its fodder because it doesn't need it. Balo we, too, you will collect. Now, for the I'm sure Ashnuk, there is no special ending for me, so we can forget about that if we're saying me, it's Dun he may, Brish he may. Kino we may, balo we may. But as usual, we do have a special ending for we. Femij or Hamij. Dun Hamij. Here it is again. Femij or Hamij. Both pronunciations are correct. Missing the A because it's narrow. Brish Hamij. O image. Okay, you can see how that relates to the OE up above. It's like the OE ending but with a Mij on the end. So, Kano image. And you can probably guess what's coming next. O image with an E. Balo image. Just like our I'm sure Leuchruck, our question is on. And our negative answer is knee. It's only in the I'm sure Katja that's, that's different where it's air and near. So again, like last week, why am I telling you all of this when we're going to be looking at an irregular verb now? It's so that you see the patterns of how it's supposed to be. And then when you go and look at the irregular verb that has its weird little differences, it's much easier for you to remember the weird little differences. If you know how something should look, it's easy to figure out when it looks different. Okay. Okay, so we are looking at Dane, the verb to make or to do. The reason we're looking at this one specifically is because it is irregular. Just like te, which we learned about last week, Dane is irregular. It looks different from one tense to another and it breaks some of our rules that we're used to. So let's have a look. I'm sure Katja, Rinna. So straight away we can see Rinna looks nothing like Dane. If it was, 
a regular verb, we would expect the root of the verb to be the same all the way across. Dane, 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 no matter what we were dealing with. But it's Rinna. So Rinna may, I made. Our we version of it is Rinna mer, we made or we did. So you could be using this for talking about, you know, making art, making food, cooking dinners, doing your homework. It's a verb you will use an awful lot. Now look at the question again, similar to Tay last week. The question word here looks absolutely nothing like any other part of the verb. On nyarna. And you'd answer that with, yeah, rename, I did make, I did do. But your negative answer, ni yarna. So that's one to really watch there. Rinna looks totally different from Dane. And the question and negative answer, on yarna and ni yarna look totally different again. Now, the good news is the rest of the verb is pretty straightforward. So in our I'm sure Leuchruck, Janum for I do, Jane and to, she, she for you do, just like the regular ones we've been looking at so far. Jane Amige, we make or do, again, just like all the other regular ones we've been looking so far. On Janum, using on and an uru, Janum, yes, I do make or do. Ni Janum, no, I don't make or do. So again, all of the rules here in the I'm sure Lie Rook, they do look like they would in a regular verb. So we don't have too much extra to learn here. Then onto the I'm sure Oshnuk. Jane he, just like we just saw in the last slide, that is the ending that we would expect this to have. Jane Femij, Jane Hemij, again, just like we would have expected. On Jane he, using on and using an uru. Jane he, yeah, I, I will, I will make it, I will do it. And ni Jane he, no, I won't do that, no, I won't make that. So what we can see here with Dane is that for the large part, it does obey all of the rules of the regular verbs. The only weird place we have to look is the I'm sure Katja, which looks totally different and particularly the question and answer. But everything else there is fairly straightforward. So I want you to have a look at this and try your best this week to write your sentences in the I'm sure Katja, I'm sure Leuchruk, I'm sure Oshnuk, and have a go at doing some questions and answers. And again, if I was you doing my questions and answers, I'd probably focus on the I'm sure Katja the most because that's where the weird difference is. Okay, good luck with that.